हेलो एवरीवन वार्म गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू वुड लाइक टू वेलकम टू दिस सेशन होप यू ऑल आर गुड सो टू विल डिस्कस द फेमिनिज्म ऑफ पॉलिटिकल आइडियोलॉजी एंड इट इम्पोर्टेंस फॉर एस एस बी पी जी टी टी जी टी यू जी सी नेट एंड ऑल द एग्जामिनेशन रिलेटेड टू द पॉलिटिकल साइंस सो विदाउट डिले लेट स्टार्ट आवर डिस्कसन hope you able to clearly pictureize the feminism and a beautiful icon so guys before let you start this topic would like to uh, take you all to the homework question of uh, the last session uh, in which you did discuss about uh, communism so the homework question that provided by me that consider the following statement about new marxism and choose incorrect guys you need to find incorrect option a it was originated from the frankfurt school correct option b it was critic to exploitation during capitalist society option c jojen habermas is thinker of the discourse correct it was option b it was critic to the exploitation during capitalist society no h multiple time i did explain to you new marxism was a criticized to a the post capitalist society okay post capitalist society so the answer option b is the answer they ask incorrect and option b is the incorrect so let's this is how the your answer so let's discuss the feminism feminism so actually i have discussed with you that first what we need to do with respect to the examinations first we will discuss the previous year question puiq of the topic related feminism and will not only discuss puiq but also analyze the pattern of question and that basis will cover the topic hope you all agree with this point and on this note let's start first question in front of you what constitute a feature of egalitarian feminism option a essentialism option b sisterhood option d gender equality option option c gender equality option d sexual liberation answer option c gender equality deals with egalitarian feminism we know the answer but the thing is that guys what is the method that we should incorporate while we cover the topic we need to cover the principle with respect to feminism and that is important for our examination so come to the question egalitarian feminism gender equality okay so gender equality the answer moving to the next question personal is political is a central slogan of option a socialist b feminist c new liberal d fascist what does it answers so answer option b feminist obviously we all know personal is political idea belongs to feminist and here we have to understand the different web of feminism so what is the web feminism we will discuss that thing okay okay and that kind of question are from this part so personal is political feminist moving to the next question how radical feminist understand the patriarchy it is a monogamous family it is a system of cooperation a form of patriotism and the system of oppression okay so the according to radical feminist the patriarchy is a system of oppression and it is a system of domination exploitation and that need to completely eliminate from its roots so here we know all the the answer of the radical feminist of this question but the thing is that we should focus we should keep in our mind when we cover the different types of feminism within feminism there are the different types of feminism okay and we need to cover that types of feminism okay be it your radical be it your socialist liberal all the things now now this is all above our question from ssb or uh, pgt this question are from pgt 2023 if you have a if you have a notice you can know now we will switch to the is net piq and will understand what you need to really focus 
सो क्वेश्चन दैट हुईच वन ऑफ द फेयर इज नॉट करेक्टली मैच ऑप्शन ए रियलिज्म स्टेट करेक्ट डिपेंडेंस थियोरी रिलेटेड टू इकोनॉमिक कॉन्सेप्ट करेक्ट फेमिनिज्म जेंडर करेक्ट ग्लोबालीजम नॉन स्टेट एक्टर नो ग्लोबालीजम द स्टेट द टॉक्स अबाउट द नेचर ऑफ द स्टेट हैज बीन ट्रांसफॉर्मड ड्यू टू द एरा ऑफ ग्लोबालाइजेशन और ग्लोबालीजम सपोर्ट द आइडिया ऑफ ग्लोबालाइजेशन वाई आई आई इनक्रप्ट दिस क्वेश्चन बिकॉज हियर द फेमिनिज्म कॉन्सेप्ट आर देर एंड वी नीड टू वी नो ऑल द आंसर बट द थिंग वी नीड टू कवर द फेमिनिज्म एंड इट्स रिलेटेड कॉन्सेप्ट मुविंग टू द नेक्स्ट इको फेमिनिज्म वाज अ स्पेशल फीचर ऑफ ऑप्शन ए साइलेंट वैली दैन दिस स्ट्रगल देन चिपको मूवमेंट एंड ऑप्शन डी नॉन ऑफ देवम व्हाट इज द आंसर ओके ओके होप यू आई विल प्रोवाइड ऑप्शन सी चिपको मूवमेंट रिलेट टू द इको फेमिनिज्म डू यू रिमेम्बर द उत्तराखंड उत्तराखंड वेर द चिपको मूवमेंट वाज स्टार्टेड स्टार्टेड एंड इट वाज द सुंदरलाल बहुगुणा हु लीड दिस मूवमेंट ओके सो चिपको मूवमेंट सुंदरलाल बहुगुणा वाई इट इज फेमिनिस्ट मूवमेंट बिकॉज मेनली द ओमेन आर लीड दिस मूवमेंट it was not for their rights but it the women who organize and gather and that popularized as a women movement or eco feminist movement because it is the women protect their the environment the culture okay so that is the option c is answer the chipko movement in uttarakhand guys do you know the year of chipko movement so please search the year of chipko movement okay the year where the Chipko movement basically start. So please search. Then so answer of this question the eco feminism Chipko movement. Okay, that's all. Then next question arrange the ideological focus feminist movement under the different stage in chronological order. Option A focus on right to vote for women. Option B focus on social economic equality. Option C focus on culture and contest cultural and contest. Option D focus on eco feminism. So what is the correct chronology stages of chronology under the ideological focus of feminist movement okay okay option a is answer here a b c d because if you if you will study and you will able to remember option a focus to write to the vote for women liberal liberal feminism option option b focus on social and economic equality socialist feminism socialist feminism option c cultural socialist feminism or second wave option c cultural and the contest cultural contest it is your like third wave feminism and option d focus on eco feminism it is a contemporary trend under eco logic we study the eco feminism we study the eco feminism so we know answer but the thing is that we need to cover the different wave of feminism the different the evolution period of the feminism with respect to the development of the feminist movement okay okay so answer this is how option a the ideological focus of feminist movement so moving to the next question here the thinker and their book okay book and thinker and you need to match okay option a katherine mackinnon option b susan muller okin option c uh, sulamit firestone option d bell hook and the book feminism is for everyday dialectic sex towards a feminist theory of state justice gender and family so we need to match her like let's match katherine mackinnon towards a feminist theory of state susan muller okin susan muller okin justice gender and family sulamit firestone dialectic of sex bell hook the feminist feminism is for everyday so we know answer but the thing is that we have to focus the different book with respect to the different thinker under the feminism okay feminism because this is the trend and we learn this thing from the piq so that is the objective to solve the piq if you notice if you notice each and every of mine video first start with piq and and last i end with the related a mock expected question so this piq not only help us to cover the topic but also our preparation is going on examination orientation so what is the answer you can match catherine mackinnon 
टुवर्ड्स ए फेमिनिस्ट थ्योरी सोलह मत फेस्ट ऑन जस्टिस जेंडर सो थ्री एंड फोर ऑप्शन सी इवन इफ यू नो वन ऑप्शन यू कुड एबल टू प्रोवाइड द आंसर सो गाइज दिस इज ऑल योर प्रिफेसर क्वेश्चन विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू फेमिनिजम ऑफ पॉलिटिकल आइडियोलॉजी एंड अंडर दिस क्वेश्चन यू विल ट्राई टू कवर द कम्प्रिहेन्सिव द मोस्ट एक्सपेक्टेड कॉन्सेप्ट एंड थ्योरी इन ए कम्प्रिहेन्सिव वे विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू फेमिनिजम एंड दैट मेक्स से श्योर यू दैट द एनी काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन यू विल एबल टू आंसर इन योर एक्जामेसन मुविंग टू आवर थ्योरी पार्ट एंड बिफोर covering the theory would like to request to all of you please subscribe our channel if you have not subscribed and if you like our effort please like the bell icon and also share with your friend because if you share the people the more you will be feel helpful and the more you will feel that you are a responsible guys because be remember as someone did share you with this link of youtube channel so hope you subscribe and show to me the support this is the one motivation for me okay moving to the uh, next the our today's agenda that lesson outcome okay so what we will study under this political ideology feminism as i know you guys well ever about political ideology feminism but i will try to discuss those area which going to help you revise the topics and also maximize the chances of the selection by revising the main core core idea option the first lesson outcome what we will cover we will cover introduction to the feminism cover principle of the feminism like what is personality political the gender equality sex and gender concept what is the concept of patriarchy or moving to the next we will cover web of feminisms okay uh, as a movement and moving to the type of feminism last not the least we will cover thinker and contribution so this is all the idea or lesson outcome after completion of this lesson you would able to cover these major movement with respect feminism types its uh, the thinker and the books so without delay let's start so first introduction the feminism as a political ideology born during the 19th and 20th century for a welfare of the women so first try to ask why feminism ideology is required as we have discussed the liberalism ideology socialism ideology uh, communism ideology so why there is a requirement of feminism as a good number of ideology are there the thing is that no one ideology specially focused the issue or problem of the women that's why it was realized that women are missing women issue are not addressed and feminism as a political ideology emerged for the welfare of the women okay moving to the next sinica fall convention 1848 as a landmark moment for the women movement question here questions although this part for your just general understanding but here you will get question sinica fall convention related to what that is how women movement question so this the way they basically frame the question okay and they can ask the question sinica fall convention in which year 1848 or in which area it is usa okay then major principle of the feminism the gender equality rights and personal is political what is personal is political we all know personal is political is part of the feminism ideology what is personal is political so let's study so personal is political personal is political coined by karl hernitz okay so please remember karl hernitz basically coined the term personal is political and kate miller developed this idea initially the political scientist defends the term political include the government structure state political party and bureaucracy but feminist thinker redefine the political here you will get a question that which political ideology redefine the term political that is feminism feminism ideology redefine the term political 
and it deals with the conflict domination social authority and political theory should and political theory should extend the scope of political up to the family as a social structure hence women issue no longer a private issue so if you will be like uh, surprised sir you are like studying like a sing, singing a song no let's understand the personal is political what does it mean so personal is political your initial scientist political scientist explain the term political what is the term political if you will open the opigaba book there is a mention political term an initial thinker try to explain the term political which associate with the what the government structure the political party the idea of state when he talks about political that deals the idea of states or the bureaucracy or the power or the structure of the government okay legislature educated judiciary that is a political even if in our article 13 mention the concept of the what is article 12 mention the idea or meaning of the state that is political but your feminist thinker try to redefine the term political try to redefine the term political according to cat miller according to cat miller the political okay the political is not only deals with the your state how it deals with the family here like in family you found there is a conflict there is a dominations and there is a social authority and who exercise this all thing men okay male male exercise the social authority or economic authority and domination over the women okay so here you found what the political relationships because this social authority this exercise of dominance exercising of the power over the other community over the other class that is known as what the aspect of political relationships because political talks about your structure of the power the authority okay uh, the law and order and the domination and cohesion but this thing also if you deeply analyze in family the women are exploited by the men the women are dominated by the men the male control the all the, the all liberty and the all the rights of the women so here the concept of controlling are come pictures okay here the idea of rights are uh, come to the picture so whenever there is a, this political concept at the part then how can you say the family is a private issue okay okay so how can the family is a private issue from this logic uh, the feminist thinker redefine the term political they argue the political concept not deals with only the structure of the state or political party but also it include the women the include the family include the exploitation of women in the family so they try to give a deeper understanding here okay so hope you able to understand this concept what is personal is political they argue the personal is no longer a private the personal is a political part and the initial thinker like hobbes locke rousseau they basically neglect to addressing this uh, term into the political and that's why the feminism political ideology uh, emerged why the feminism feminism political ideology emerged they basically try to include the system in political system because if you for example in the current society also you will find the women issue are missing okay okay for example in the current scenario election is going on if you deeply analyze out of 1000 candidate are contesting for 543 lok sabha seats how many women are there contesting in the election there are less number of men you will found contesting the election and this electoral process this uh, like the parliament structure legislative process the women are not the found the women are missing and your feminism ideology talks about the women should include the women issue should be uh, portrayed in the electoral process okay the women issue should be po- po- portrayed in the manifesto of the political party okay that is how political women's issue also political so they trying to say that women need to should include in the political sphere okay and the uh, like this term political should be redefined then the women can include in the state system in the electoral process in the elections in the political manifesto of the political party 
सो स्टिल द फेमिनिस्ट आर नट अचिव इट्स सो कलड सक्से वी कैन से दैट बिकज पर्सनाल इज पलिटिकल स्टिल वी नोट दिस कैंड अफ थिंगस आर नेग्लेक्टेड टू द ओमेन स्टिल ओमेन इश्यू आर नट इनक्लूड इन द पलिटिकल मानिफेस्टो अफ एनी पलिटिकल पार्टी ओके इवेन इफ द ओमेन आर नट रेडी टू एबल टू कंटेस्ट इन द इलेक्शन ओके सो दैट इज हाउ पर्सनाल इज पॉलिटिकल दे ट्राइ टू एनालाइज योर दैट द कॉन्फ्लिक्ट द डोमेसन द सोशल अथोरीटी एंड पॉलिटिकल थिरी सुड इनक्लूड दिस थिंग इन द पॉलिटिकल बिकज इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द गवर्नमेंट इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द स्टेट एंड व्हाट अबाउट द फैमिली फैमिली आल्सो एक्सपीरियंस सेम काइंड ऑफ एक्सप्लोटेशन डोमिनेशन कोहरेशन भावलेशन एंड दैट सुड इनक्लूड इन द पॉलिटिकल और द लेजिस्लेसन और द लॉ मेकिंग प्रोसेस ऑफ द आवर सो कॉलर लेजिस्लेचर सो दैट इज हाउ पर्सनल इज पॉलिटिकल दैट इज द आइडिया बट द थिंग इज दैट यू नीट रिमेम्बर काल हर्निज कॉइन द टर्म पर्सनल इज पॉलिटिकल एंड कैट मिलर डेवलपड दिस आइडिया मुविंग टू द नेक्स्ट एज ए सेक्स एंड जेंडर डिस्ट्रमेशन बाय द फेमिनिस्ट अकॉर्डिंग टू एज पर द फेमिनिजम जेंडर इज ए सोशियाल कन्स्ट्रक्ट जेंडर इज ए सोशियाल कन्स्ट्रक्ट ओके सिंपली यू कैन गेट ए क्वेश्चन दैट टू हूम जेंडर इज ए सोशियाल कन्स्ट्रक्ट इट्स द फेमिनिजम ओके सो जेंडर इज ए सोशियाल कन्स्ट्रक्ट इज ए फेमिनिजम सो दिस इज हाउ द बेसिक आइडिया अबाउट द पॉलिटिकल आइडियोलोजी एज ए फेमिनिजम नाउ विल क्विकली सी द डिफरेन्ट वेब अफ फेमिनिजम different wave of feminism different wave of feminism and basic information information first wave feminism i am quickly discuss that it origin 1850 and 1920s okay and core the women suffrage so first there uh, first wave feminism deal with the right to vote okay so right to vote okay so here you will get a question like chronology base okay first right to vote and new zealand new zealand the first state to grant right to vote for women in 1893 so can they can simply ask the question which state first to grant right to vote for women new zealand okay do remember new zealand okay so new zealand the first state to grant the right to vote for women then national women suffrage association was created in usa where usa नेशनल वोमेन सफरेज एसोसिएशन वाज क्रिएटेड इन 1869 सो दे कैन सिंपली आस्ट द क्वेश्चन नेशनल वोमेन सफरेज एसोसिएशन वाज क्रिएटेड इन व्हिच प्लेस यूएसए ओके हियर यू विल गेट वन क्वेश्चन आल्सो देन स्कॉलर एलिजाबेथ सांथोन एंड सुसन बी एंथोनी दे आर द इंपोर्टेंट स्कॉलर ऑफ द फास्ट वेव फेमिनिज्म सो मेनली यू नीड टू रिमेंबर द फास्ट वेव फेमिनिज्म डील्स विद द राइट टू वोट दैट्स ऑल ओके राइट टू वोट फास्ट वेव फेमिनिज्म ओके देन सेकंड वेव फेमिनिज्म started in 1960 to the 1980s okay and personal is political famous slogan belong to the second wave of feminism simply they can ask the question so personal and polit- personal is political belongs to which wave of feminism it the second wave of the feminism and core idea equal pay for equal work equal pay for equal work the slogan of the second wave feminism like first wave right to vote and second wave the equal pay for equal work then scholar cat millet german gire बेटी फ्रीडान ओके बेटी फ्रीडान जर्मान गिरे एंड कैट मिलेट द सेकेंड वेव फेमिनिजम ओके सो सेकेंड वेव फेमिनिजम कैट मिलेट जर्मान गिरे एंड बेटी फ्रीडान एंड कोर आइडिया ऑफ सेकेंड वेव फेमिनिजम दैट पर्सनाल इज पॉलिटिकल ओके पर्सनाल इज पॉलिटिकल सो दैट स्मल स्मल थिंग इन यू टू रिमेम्बर दैट्स एन ऑफ फर एक्जामेसन मुविंग टू द नेक्स्ट थार्ड वेव फेमिनिजम थार्ड वेव फेमिनिजम नाइंटीन नाइंटीज टू द प्रेजेंट ओके नाइंटीन नाइंटी टू द प्रेजेंट हियर यू विल बी अंडर कभर पोस्ट प्रडन फेमिनिजम रेसियाल एंड एथनिक्स दिस टाइप अफ कम्स अंडर थार्ड वेब्स एंड स्कोलर रेबिका वर्लकर किम्बर्ली क्रिन्सा एंड जुडिट बटलर ओके सो जुडिट बटलर किम्बर्ली क्रिन्सा रेबिका वर्लकर कम्स अंडर द थार्ड वेब फेमिनिजम एंड दे मेनली कन्सर्ट द आइडिया ऑफ पोस्ट मडर्ण फेमिनिजम दलित फेमिनिजम रेसियाल फेमिनिजम एथनिक फेमिनिजम दिस टाइप अफ फेमिनिज कन्सेप्ट आर कम्स अंडर द थार्ड वेब फेमिनिजम सो दिस इज अल्ल वि डिस्कस द वेब अफ फेमिनिजम भेरी सक्सेसफुल हियर यू विल गेट डट अफ क्वेश्चन ओके then 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 moving to the types of feminism okay so types of feminism and basic feature okay so there are different type liberal socialist radical black post colonial eco feminism and let's quickly revise the types of feminism liberal feminism a first wave with liberal ideology equal work equal legal and political rights and keep opponent mary wilson craft js mill betty friedan and carol patman okay so liberal feminism like we have already studied the liberalism a political ideology which 
बिलीव्स इन इंडिविजुअलिजम्स ओके द लिबर्टी ऑफ इंडिविजुअल्स सो हियर द फेमिनिजम कनेक्ट द लिबराल आइडियोलॉजी विथ देर द इक्वाल राइट फॉर द वोमेन और इक्वाल पॉलिटिकल राइट फॉर वोमेन एज द मेन ओके इक्वाल लीगल एंड पॉलिटिकल राइट फॉर मेन एंड वोमेन बिकज द लिबराल आइडियोलॉजी बिलीव द इंडिविजुअल फ्रीडम एज ए ह्यूमान्स द बोथ शुड गेट द इक्वाल लीगल एंड पॉलिटिकल राइट्स एंड की प्रोपोनेट मैरी लुस्टन क्राफ्ट जेस मिल बेटी फ्रीडान कारोल पार्टमेंट ओके सो बेटी फ्रीडान कारोल पार्टमेंट जेस मिल मैरी लुस्टन क्राफ्ट बिलंग टू द लिबराल फेमिनिजम ओके जस्ट रिमेम्बर द स्मल स्मल थिंग दैट इज भेरी इंपोर्टाट मुविंग टू द नेक्स्ट सोशलिस्ट फेमिनिजम एंड इट very easy to understand because you have already discussed the socialism uh, socialism and here socialist feminism means what so they el- talks about the elimination of capitalist lead male dominations okay like socialism talks about the elimination of uh, the capitalist society similarly socialist feminist believes the capitalist society dominated by the male society that's why this capitalist society lead male should be eliminate and it can eliminate okay that is the main idea that the things and proponent here charles fourier frederick angel august bebel juliet michel sila rodbom okay sila rodbom so sila rodbom august boban frederick angel they are the socialist feminist okay so do remember socialist feminist why i am like a, a portrayed this name and the thinker because simply they can ask the question that which of the following thinker belong to socialist feminist or not so you need to remember charles fourier frederick angel august bebel juliet michels and sila rodbom they are the socialist feminism then moving to the radical feminism so radical feminism with a revolutionary way to curb the existing patriarchal society from its roots okay like we have a study uh, under the marxism that marxism talks about to uh, revolu- to completely Uh, 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 eliminate the capitalist society with a violent with a bloody revolution similarly radical feminism talks about to, to eliminate the system of uh, oppression okay the patriarchal system of oppression or exploitation domination should be eliminated with a single stroke with a violent way in a radical way okay from its root from its root it should be eliminated okay so that is a revolutionary idea radical feminism thinker virginia wolf okay virginia wolf famous uh, essay the room of one one okay a room of one's own okay virginia wolf wrote a famous uh, book that is how a सो भार्जिना वल्फ रोट ए बुक ए रूम ऑफ वन्स ओन ओके ए रूम ऑफ वन्स ओन ए रूम ऑफ ए रूम ऑफ वन्स ओन ओके वन्स ओन एंड इट्स ए वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट एंड सिग्निफिकेंट बुक हियर हि हाइलाइट्स द डिफरेंट प्रॉब्लम फेस बाय द वोमेन ओके एंड द कम टू योर रेडिकल फेमिनिजम भार्जिना वल्फ साइमन डी बिभियर सोलामित फायर स्टोन केट मिलर जर्मान गिरे इभा पेबेस ओके दे आर द इम्पोर्टेंट थिंकर ओके सो टू द रेडिकल फेमिनिजम ओके भार्जिनाल साइमन डी बिभियर सोलामित फायरस्टोन केट मिलर जर्मान गिरे एंड इभा पेबेस सो दे आर द इम्पोर्टेंट थिंकर टू द रेडिकल फेमिनिजम ओके ओके देन मुविंग टू द नेक्स्ट ब्लाक फेमिनिजम ओके सो ब्लाक फेमिनिजम वेस्टर्न प्रॉब्लम अकॉर्डिंग टू देम वेस्टर्न प्रॉब्लम ऑफ वोमेन इज नॉट इक्वल टू द क्राइसिस ऑफ द थर्ड वर्ल्ड प्रॉब्लम ओके okay, वाई द ब्लैक फेमिनिजम ओरिजिनेट्स सो ब्लैक फेमिनिजम लाइक इफ यू रिमेम्बर इन वेस्टर्न सोसाइटी द सो कलड पॉलिटिकल आइडियोलॉजी फेमिनिजम बेसिकली एमोर्चड सो दे प्रेजेंट अ यूनिवर्सल आइडिया दैट ऑल वोमेन फ्रॉम द डिफरेंट पार्ट ऑफ वर्ल्ड फेस ए सिंगल फेस ए यूनिवर्सल प्रॉब्लम फेस ए यूनिवर्सल प्रॉब्लम बट योर थर्ड वर्ल्ड कंट्री women experience such unique problem because they are the colonialist country after the independence uh, there is still the racism there, there is still people are not exploited due to the sex but due to the race but due to the culture even if in usa the black fem- black women are struggling to get their due rights because they still exploited due to their race due to their culture okay so that's why there is a still the inequality exists between the white women and black women and here the black women criticized the western women movement 
ओके दे कंसिडर द वेस्टर्न प्रॉब्लम ऑफ वमेन इज नॉट इक्वेलेंट टू द क्राइसिस विथ वर्ल्ड वोमेन एंड हियर मेन आर्गुमेंट दैट वाई ऑल द प्रॉब्लम ऑफ वेस्टर्न इज कंसिडर द प्रॉब्लम ऑफ द वर्ल्ड से फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ यू रिमेम्बर वेन टेररिज्म वेन टेररिज्म अटैक डिड अटैक ऑन यू एस ए इन टू थाउजेंड वन देन द टेररिज्म एगेनेस्ट वार एगेनेस्ट टेररिज्म बिकेम पॉपुलर डू यू नॉट थिंक दैट बिफोर द टू थाउजेंड वन देर इज ए टेररिज्म कन्सेप्ट प्रिभेलेंट बट वेन इट अटैक टू द यू एस ए देन यू एस ए ट्राई टू पॉपुलराइज दैट कन्सेप्ट दैट द टेररिज्म शुड एलिमिनेट सो हियर द थर्ड वर्ल्ड स्कोलर हाईलाइट दैट ऑल द प्रॉब्लम फेस बाय द वेस्टर्न सोसाइटी इट इज नॉट द प्रॉब्लम फॉर द होल वर्ल्ड ओके ओके सो वी नीड टू वी नीड टू वी नीड टू ट्राई टू शॉर्ट आउट द प्रॉब्लम ऑफ डिफरेंट वे द फेस बाय द डिफरेंट सिनारी ओके दैट इज अ ब्लैक फेमिनिजिम दे एलिमिनेट द यूनिवर्सल सिस्टरहुड ओके सिंपली यू कैन गेट ए क्वेश्चन हु हु एज अ क्रिटिक टू द यूनिवर्सल सिस्टरहुड दैट इज अ ब्लैक फेमिनिजिम ब्लैक फेमिनिजिम क्रिटिसाइज द यूनिवर्सल सिस्टरहुड एंड देर कोर रेस एथेनिसीटी एज ए बेसिस फॉर एनालिसिस ऑफ द ओमेन इश्यू ओके एंड स्कोलर सुजन ट्रूथ आना जुलिया कुपर एंड बेल हुक डू रिमेम्बर बेल हुक्स इम्पोर्टाट स्कोलर टू द ब्लैक फेमिनिजिम सो ब्लैक फेमिनिजिम क्रिटिसाइज द यूनिवर्सल सिस्टरहुड दैट सल्व मुविंग टू द नेक्स्ट पोस्ट कॉलोनियल फेमिनिजिम नोन एज ए थर्ड वर्ल्ड फेमिनिज फेमिनिजिम विथ अंडरस्टैंडिंग अफ रेसिजिम एथनिक्स इश्यू कम्प्रिहेन्सिव इफेक्ट अफ द पोस्ट कॉलोनियालीजिम एंड इट क्रिटिसाइज द आर्गुमेंट अफ वेस्टर्न फेमिनिजिम एंड स्कोलर चंद्रा महांती ओके चंद्रा महांती द पोस्ट कॉलोनियल फेमिनिजिम सो इफ यू रिमेम्बर ब्लैक फेमिनिजिम इट्स इम वेरी इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड सो पोस्ट कॉलोनियल फेमिनिजिम डील्स विथ द कम्प्रिहेन्सिव इफेक्ट अफ अ कॉलोनियालीजिम्स ओके डू यू नो एज यू नो दैट आवर थार्ड वर्ल्ड कंट्री लाइक एसिया आफ्रिका लैटिन अमेरिका दे वेर अंडर द कॉलोनियालीस्ट रूल वेन दे गट इंडिपेडेन्स स्टिल द प्रॉब्लम्स स्टिल द लाइक साइकैट्रिक और साइकोलो साइकोलॉजिकल प्रॉब्लम प्रिभेलेंट इन द पोस्ट इंडिपेडेन्स और कॉलोनियल कंट्री द वे दे आर सब्जुकेटेड इन द कॉलोनियल पीरियड सेम काइंड ऑफ साइकोलॉजिकल ट्रोमा प्रिभेलेंट इन देर माइंड एंड टू एलिमिनेट दिस कॉलोनियल सोशियोपॉलिटिकल इफेक्ट इन द पोस्ट द कॉलोनियलिस्ट कंट्री और थर्ड वर्ल्ड कंट्री द पो द द न्यू काइंड ऑफ इनिशिएटिव और न्यू काइंड ऑफ सॉल्यूशन इज रिक्वायर सो द वेस्टर्न लेड ओमेन और फेमिनिस्ट मूवमेंट इज नॉट सॉल्यूशन ओके सो दैट 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 बेसिकली आइडिया बेसिकली दे ट्राइंग टू हाईलाइट एंड द फेमस स्कॉलर द चंद्रा महांती ओके पोस्ट कॉलोनल फेमिनिजिम डू रिमेम्बर चंद्रा महांती देन इको फेमिनिजिम इको फेमिनिजिम ओके सो इफ क्लियर पोस्ट कॉलोनल फेमिनिजिम चंद्रा महांती ओके इको फेमिनिजिम द वार्ड कॉइन बाय फ्रांकस डी ओवन ओके सो अनएबल टू प्रोनाउंसिंग बट द फ्रांकस डी ओवेन हू कॉइन द इको फेमिनिजिम एंड इको हाट डज इट मीन बाय इको फेमिनिजिम दैट ओमेन वैल्यू शुड बी इनकरपरेट विथ सोशियो इकोनोमिक एंड पॉलिटिकल सेट ऑफ्स ओके सो इको फेमिनिजिम दे बिलीव्स इफ यू इफ यू इनक्लूड द ओमेन वैल्यू विथ नेचर विथ एनवरमेंट विथ आवर सराउंडिंग देन द एनवरमेंट विल प्रोटेक्ट देन द आवर सोसाइटी विल प्रोटेक्ट से फॉर एग्जाम्पल द मेन एज ए एज वी नो द मेन एज ए सिम्बल अफ एग्रेसन्स द मेन द वन हू इनिशिएट द वार ओके से फॉर एग्जाम्पल रिसेंटली हामास एंड पालेस्टाइन एंड इजराइल वार इज गोईंग ऑन एंड हु इनवल्व इन दिस वार मेन ओनली इनवल्व दिस वार और वी कैन से दैट द इजराइल गवर्नमेंट नितेन याहू इज ए मैन हू डिक्लेयर अ वार सो द मेल डिक्लेयर द वार एंड दैट डेस्ट्रय द एनवरमेंट थ्रो द न्यूक्लियर रिपन्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ इन नितेन याहू देर इज ए ओमेन हेड इन द योर बेसिकली वेर द इजराइल्स देन एकॉर्डिंग टू इको फेमिनिजिम द वार इज नट गोईंग टू हेड एफ इफ देर इज ए नो वार इफ देर इज ए नो बम्बार्ड एंड न्यूक्लियर रिपन एक्सप्लोजन देन द एनवरमेंट विल प्रोटेक्ट सो दैट इको फेमिनिजिम ट्राई टू हाईलाइट द फेमे फिमेल वैल्यूज द ओमेन वैल्यू शिड शुड नीड टू इनकॉर्पोरेट इन द सोशियो पॉलिटिकल इनवरमेंट इन द सोशियो पॉलिटिकल सार्कोस्टांस सो दैट इज हाउ इको फेमिनिजिम्स आइडिया होप यू आदल टू कनेक्ट विथ दिस करेन्ट एक्जाम्पल देन स्कोलर बंदना शिभा एंड मारिया सिल्स ओके 
मारिया मिल्स एंड बंधना सिबा दे आर द इंपोर्टेंट स्कॉलर टू द इको फेमिनिज्म सो इको फेमिनिज्म बंधना सिबा डू रिमेंबर ओके डू रिमेंबर देन आई एम गोइंग टू स्विच डिस्कस द थिंकर एंड कंट्रीब्यूशन सो डिफरेंट थिंकर रोट ए डिफरेंट बुक एंड देयर आईडिया एंड इट इज इंपोर्टेंट बिकॉज दे हैव आस्क द क्वेश्चन एंड दे विल आस्क सो लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड अ भेंडिकेशन ऑफ राइट ऑफ ओमेन मारियल स्टोन क्राफ्ट सो हु रोट ए बुक भेंडिकेशन ऑफ राइट ऑफ ओमेन मारियल स्टोन क्राफ्ट एंड दिस बुक इज अ सिग्निफिकेंट सिग्निफिकेंट स्टेप फॉर द ओमेन कंसर्न ओके ओमेन इज ए मैटर ऑफ कंसर्न इनिशिएटेड फ्रॉम दिस बुक एंड इट वाज रिटर्न इन व्हिच ईयर 1792 टू ओके सेवेंटीन नाइन्टी बुक टू बिकज दिस इज एज ए फेमस बुक कैन बी आर आज द इयर अल्सो ओके सब्जुकेशन अफ ओमेन जे एस मिल ओके सब्जुकेशन अफ ओमेन जे एस मिल रोट ए बुक सब्जुकेशन अफ ओमेन सैमन डी बिभिअर सैमन डी बिभिअर डेभलपड ए कन्सेप्ट ओमेन एज ए अदर मैन दे कैन सिंपली आस्क द क्वेश्चन दैट हु कॉन इट द टर्म ओमेन एज ए अदर मैन सो ओमेन एज ए अदर मैन सैमन डी बिभिअर एंड इन दिस कन्सेप्ट दे हाइलाइट That woman is a other man. That means that what does it mean? Okay, so women, women are treated as a other. Okay, so women are now as a what? That other means try to understand according to Simon de Beauvoir. The woman lost its significant uh, essence. The women are dehumanized. Now a day, women are now not uh, do their work accordingly. the women are now commodified so if you ask me what does it mean so now the women are like uh, 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 construct or teach in such a way that they should uh, they should do like they should do behave in that way that to other can please so i mean to say that now the women are now uh, like consider as other that they no any identity are exist okay according to simon de beauvoir that women are always try to please other women are always try to uh, uh, like uh, uh, that uh, uh, to attract other so why this kind of uh, the uh, the uh, tag associated with women so that kind of thing or dehumanized should be eliminated according to simon de beauvoir and he wrote a book second sex so do remember simon de beauvoir uh, concept women as a other okay other of man concept and the like books second sex okay second sex and women as other of man the idea of simon de beauvoir and we already discussed simon de beauvoir belongs to your radical feminism okay radical feminism then betty friedan the feminist mystic you and the term housewife okay the term housewife what does it mean by happy housewife okay he coined the term happy housewife happy housewife means most of people thinks that the women life are good and they are live a life with very happy because they no need to go outside the state they no need to go outside the home for earning the money and that portrait is a happy house and betty prudman question this storm did a question mark this storm they asked the women are not really happy ओके एज दे पोर्ट्रेटेड बाय द सोसाइटी दे आर हाउ हैप्पी वाइज द ओमेन आर सब्जुगेटेड इन द फैमिली द ओमेन आर नॉट अलाउड टू वर्क आउटसाइड द होम और आउटसाइड द कंट्री बिकॉज दे आर ओमेन सो दे शुड गेट एजुकेटेड दे शुड गेट द इक्वल राइट्स विथ द काउंटर पार्ट ऑफ द मेल एंड दिस द हैप्पी वाइज इज ए डिस्कालीफिकेसन इट इज ए Uh, we can say that uh, unfulfillment of the women's interest in the home and the happy wife is a negative connotation just to show the exploit the women's okay here betty friedman highlights that we most of time consider ladies first we consider the ladies first that means what ladies are weak why we are consider ladies first because we consider ladies weak and they need protection that's why they should allow in first place so they ask by the name of providing the so called legacy or le- elegant we don't require to uh, like uh, exploit in the uh, using the like high big big term okay 
big big dorm so betty friedman try to eliminate this kind of intellectual exploitation and they try to say we does not require this kind of happy wise housewife we require our equal rights so as a liberal feminist thinker he highlighted that happy housewife concept should be eliminated and it is a not a positive idea so betty friedman the feminist master q and happy wife concept then sulamit firestone the dialectical sex then cat miller sexual politics we have already discussed the idea personal is political then catherine mackinon feminist theory of state okay feminist theory of state catherine mackinon then carol patman sexual contract okay carol patman sexual contract in which he criticizes the social contract thinker of log hoff john uh, john jackis russo because they did a social contract by only the introduction of the men but here carol patman talks about it is not a social contract it is a sexual control between men and women between men and women it is a sexual control for the rights liberty equality authority and different things okay so do remember carol patman sexual control then move to the jean uh, bakhter strands public man private women and seller of bomb is a seller of the socialist uh, feminist thinker book women resistance and revolution okay women resistance and revolution okay so on this note on this note we have a successful cover the topic of uh, the feminism as a political ideology i know this lecture is quite long but believe me when you uh, try to understand it found very interesting and valuable for the examination so on this note would like to stop here thank you guys for being part of it and if you like my such effort please subscribe please like and please press the bell icon as your mark of attendance thank you guys have a nice day